What's going on, people? It's your boy, Rescued Word. And guess what I'm bringing you? That's right, a commentary. A commentary on launch. On launch. Because, you know, I like launch. Launch is a fun map. I think it's fun to do. My only problem is people that talk shit. I don't care if you went 6 and 12, bitch. I don't care if you went 64 and 5. I don't care if you didn't get a single skill kill or death, you know? Don't talk shit about the other team. I mean, it's fun. If you're doing it like joking around, you know, you're talking smack, then I don't care. But if you're literally complaining about something, you know, that like you completely made up. Like earlier, I was playing a game with a guy whose connection was so bad that he literally was skipping forward and everybody saw it, even people on his team. Even on the replay, like the kill cam, um, when it would show it, he was lagging on his screen. So obviously his connection was so bad. I don't get why though. I mean, if I have a laggy connection, like if I'm anything below, you know, perfect bar, anything below like almost perfect, I will leave. I, I will leave the game. Like uh, a couple weeks ago, my internet was really shoddy. Um, pretty much what I did was I wouldn't play. If it was any, if it was even slightly off color green, I would leave and I would wait until it was better. You know, that's just common courtesy. Don't ruin other people's experience because you want to play so bad. Don't ruin the game for other people. Don't be that guy, you know. Oh, this is awesome. I really don't know how he didn't kill me. Maybe because I got that extended mag. I have extended mag on like everything. But I mean, my whole thing is that dude that knifed me right there was the one talking shit. So basically his whole purpose of everything was that I was lagging. Apparently. I mean, my connection, I check my connection through, I always, I regularly, like, I usually check my connection throughout the game. I mean, I have good internet, I have decent internet, when it doesn't work, I don't play. Stuff like, you know, basically how it is. But, <clears throat> he had it set in his mind that I was trying, I had like a lag switch or something, or I was like a real, I don't know, he was basically just bitching the whole time. And so, first thing he says... You know, after a game ends, I usually say, you know, good game, blah, blah, blah. You know, I say, uh, we joke around, be like, oh, dude, with the tube, why are you doing to me like that, blah, blah, blah. You know, but first thing he says is not like good game or anything like that is, fuck you, rescued word, lagging ass motherfucker. And I'm like, who the hell are you talking to, dude? Because I, I was like, I know, I know what damn well I was not lagging. And he's like, yeah, you were, you bitch ass, blah, blah, blah. He's just going on and on. I don't know what I was doing right there. Maybe it would have go dove under me. I don't fucking know. Anyway, so he keeps talking shit, saying how I was lagging and got a lag switch and stuff like that. I don't know. I think it's bogus. But, so, I mean, I'm just like, dude, you're talking shit because your team got wrecked. You know, you guys may have won, but if we were playing TDM, you guys would have got wrecked. I mean, they come back, and I'm positive they're negative and stuff like that. I'm not trying to say I'm like, oh, I'm so much better than them, because I'm not. I'm really not that good of a, uh, I really am not that good. You know, I just know a thing or two about it. So, I mean, he's, like, saying all this shit, and I'm like, dude, you had some bullshit kills. You know, you lunged, like, that knife earlier. He knifed me from, like, three feet away. He just lunged. And then earlier, he panic knifed the hell out of me. So, I mean... I was just like, dude, you can't complain because I killed you, you know? And he's like, then, I guess, so he ran out of, like, reasons on why I was lagging, or saying why I was lagging. So what's he, so what's he decided to do? Oh, you're camping. You're camping. You're camping, bitch. I'm like, dude, I brought a tent with me. You know, I was helping my team, so, I mean, you can complain all you want, but the fact of the matter is, I'm, I kept you guys from taking B half the time. I mean, even if you did have B, I, I was down there, and I was killing you, I was keeping you away from it. And you two dumbasses who kept coming through, you know, you're the reason why I got so many goddamn spy plans. So, I mean, I don't care if you want to talk shit. I don't care if you want to, you know, just joke around. But, dude, don't be a douche about it. I don't, no one wants to hear that. I'm not even sure you really want to hear that. Because, really, who wants to start talking like that and just be, like, the jerk? You know, it's not fun. It really isn't. You ruin the game for other people, and that's not uh, that's not what it's all about. You mean you guys gotta have fun with it. So I mean, I'm really excited though. Last night, on a lighter note, the other day, I finally I did my du dual comp with GPI, and I have to say the dude's a fucking awesome guy. Um, <clears throat> I did. We talked for a good time a little bit, you know, beforehand. So I mean, it was fun. I had some good times. We had some, made some jokes. 
if you guys watch it, you should, if, when he throws up, he's not going to be for a while now because he's doing his, uh, 30 days of Call of Duty back in time or whatever it is. Um, though, so, when you do watch it, try to count how many times we say meow. Because, you know, I'm rocking that meow clan, baby. That clan that you don't have to try out to get in. I don't know. But, um, I am looking forward to, uh, gaming with him some more. I don't know. I'm going to try to get, get on tonight. Yeah. Because I don't even know how many people actually watch my videos for Call of Duty. You know, but if you guys do watch them, you know, then that's awesome. I would love to game with people. I do. I watch them. I mean, I had one guy who uh, added me just because of my commentary, so it was awesome. So, I mean, that's like the highlight of my, like, month right now. Um, fuck, I really don't know what to talk about. I really don't want to keep talking about the fact that people talk smack because oh tip of the day um map definitely would have to be on the map use those catwalks they're a really easy way to get around you know by i mean look it's basically just stay right in there and those catwalks you know especially if you have uh uav blackbird stuff like that you can basically see them coming down i mean you can get on the correct side i mean you hang out on those ledges you know, a good sniping spot if you can figure out how to lay down on there and not get killed. I'm sure itself can. But I mean, look, I basic, basically I just stay in there the whole time. I really would like to know where this dude, ki the dude that comes from that kills me after I capture this. I guess he like ran down. It was like the one time I would need a spy plane. I didn't have it. But it's what ifs. I don't care. You know, ba 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 ba. Bam. But I mean, I really don't know what my team was doing. I really don't. Because, I mean, I've had such horrible luck with, like, teammates lately. I'm not saying my teammates are bad, you know, because I'm not, like, great myself. I'm not to that point where I could be like, oh, yeah, you know, if I'm going... If I was, like, 60, going, pulling 63 and 3 on a regular basis, yeah, then I can complain about teammates. But, I mean, I'm not, I'm an average gamer. You know, I'm not nothing special. So, I mean, I can't really complain about it. But, I mean, I was playing, like, a game I was playing the other day, a little earlier today. I don't know what the hell the guy was doing. My whole team, like bunched up in the house on Nuketown, and basically the other team butt fucked us with a cactus, I really don't know what happened, it was very odd, it was very odd to watch it happen, <laughs> and I basically, I was just thinking I was gonna have a fun game, I had the stake out, and I was like, oh yeah, and then basically the other team, like, you know, they basically just pile drived us, and I was like, the first thing I said was, man, well my back hurts, because I literally was like the only person on that game to go positive, and it was ridiculous, so, um, I mean, I really don't know what else to talk about other than, you know, basically, I would love to game with people who watch my videos. It'd be awesome. Uh, perk of the day would definitely have to be side of hand. You know, there's definitely a number of times where I need to reload real quick. And I... So, I mean, that's basically all I have to say. I mean, I've got like 40 something seconds left. And gosh, these things are so hard to fill up, especially long. I think I'm going to do a Let's Play for Dragon Age 2. Since I did, I bought some cables the other day that allow me to, uh, so I can watch the TV and have it record. I don't just have to watch it on a little screen, like the little, uh, preview screen I get when I record. So, I mean, oh, this part's great. You, if you're gonna shoot a guy that goes around, you better damn well be prepared to shoot when you come around that corner. Just start shooting around the corner before you even get there. That'd be a good tip to do. That was a good tip. That was a great tip. But yeah, perk of the day, side of the hand, tip of the day, use, um, the map to your advantage, ledges, shit like that. So, I mean, the game's over. We lost 113 to 200. I went 32 and 10. One capture, no defense. So, yeah, guys, take it. Love it.